Let's continue playing some Path of War by Nexum. And I uh, don't remember what I was doing, but I got a reward, so I'll take that. By traveling eastward, we'll find more valuable sites to loot and get closer to the heart of the regiment in DC. Oh, okay, I just remember what I did. I just finished upgrading my headquarters to level 3 and I have access to some new buildings, barricades, and another, another gun, right? It looks like another turret. All right, let's take a look to this. All right, let me collect my steel. Ooh, starch full. Can I build like a storage or something? Oil. Oh, okay. Here comes the second, second resource of the game. All right, hold on. Before we go any mass, any any further, MG Nest. Century infantry specialized against infantry. Okay, we can build that one. Barber wire and also wall. I was thinking, and I play a little bit more after the first look episode. And I really enjoy the fact that the units are moving in only one line. There is a reason the game is called Path, because they follow a path. But if you start combining troops, even in the same line, you can do some really nasty attacks. Okay, so before we do into attack, let me start building something, probably the well, because it looks like it's important to, to get resources. Okay, uh, one more time, we're going to probably put this in front, so the cannons can protect me. I don't know. I'm guessing right now. You know what? Ooh, ooh, hold on. Hold on. No, 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 no. Let me go back. Let me go back. Let me go back. Thank you. I uh, need to build something to do. How many months? Oh, I got only one builder. That's not bueno. That's not bueno at all. I need to spend seven and I have tons of steel. Uh, what can I do? Can I upgrade something? Let me go over here. Oh, I'm already upgrade everything. And I'm, I'm a, I got the guy the missile. That's the first. Um, once you reach the. It was the training level too? No, yeah. Mm, no, I think it was one of the missions. Mm. Okay, it was was one of the single player missions that I was able to unlock the guy the missile. But I really, really wanna start building something else because I don't want I don't like when I waste resources. How many are we gonna spend? Seven if I split this up. Hold on. Ah, let's do this. Yeah, why not? Okay, we got oil. Sweet, we got oil. And we have also steel. Uh let's build something else. We can probably go for the MG Nest. Oh, that sounds like a winner. Perfect. MG Nest right in the middle. I'm gonna collect these resources. We're almost full again. That's no bueno. How long is it gonna take for the MG to get ready? Ah, we can finish this for free. Sweet! Okay. Can we up start upgrading the training center? I need a hundred. Alright. Start doing that. Uh, we can speed of things perfect training level three and now we have access to what oh we can upgrade the guided missile and upgrade also the assault and the grenadiers Ooh, interesting interesting can probably go with the um, grenadier is quite good against structure man so i really feel that i can i'm gonna keep using that one for a while so let's start upgrading that one perfect and in the meantime let's upgrade resources buildings because that's always a key oh what else what else hold on hold on before we get into Crazy, can I build any more resources building? No, only... Okay, can build a barbed wire or another wall. Let's go build another wall in here. Perfect, I'm gonna put that in there. And we're gonna build this one. Yeah, I finished for free. Barbed wire, oh, but let me see what is the stats or what is the barbed wire. Then we're just passing enemy infantry. They can run by the vehicle. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, so, you know what? Put the wire in there. No, we're gonna put the wire in front. Perfect. All right. All right. And now we have 50 command points that we can use on the battlefield. Sweet. Okay. Trying to try to get everything up and running. Okay. Everything is upgrading. Everything is up to. Yeah. Okay. Level three, guys. We are level three. So let me see if we can start upgrading down. Okay. And we're gonna do. Okay. Let's go to the next mission. Sweet. All right. So what I was doing, I was able to attack a base which was level two. I believe oh where the right is appeared, but look at this. If we attack this veteran base level three, we're gonna be able to unlock the armor car. So mm, to attack is asking me for oil. I don't have that much oil, I only have 80. So let's see, we can probably go against another base. This is this is my base, right? 
This is my base, right? Uh, well, we're we gonna travel. We're we gonna travel. What? I can move it? Oh. 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 Where, where, where am I moving the base? Oh. Okay. Okay. All right. So let's move to another section. Nice. It's good to be on the road again. Smell of small town and country. Yeah, of course it makes sense. We are the rebels, right? We're, we're moving around. We, we can't be stationary. Otherwise, the regiment is going to find us in two seconds. All right. Look across the map. Soon, the regiment occupation will fall. Go for destroy their bases and it manifest destiny. Okay. So, right. right. You see, right now I have access to some other bases. Okay. This is the territory. The limits of the territory. Perfect. Okay, now I got it. Alright, let's go into this steelworks regiment. Uh, and we're gonna attack directly. Nah, we're not gonna scout this one. <laughs> we're not gonna scout. Okay, so what are we doing? We got another uh, special uh, energy, which is our energy point. Energy points are used to launch tactical weapons, okay? They can be earned by destroying enemy power plants. Enemy power plant here and here. Both power plants are behind these two cannons. So that's trouble. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna deploy some uh, grenadiers first. Grenadiers in front, grenadiers in front. Okay, so they can take care of the cannons. And I'm gonna deploy more units. I'm gonna wait for a little bit. I know there's plenty of infantry units in the back, but we should be okay. I'm gonna start deploying infantry here and infantry here. Okay, so by the time we destroy that, there you go. Now we got some energy. Do we got enough energy? Yes, we do. <laughs> Put some guy to miss my missile in the middle of the enemy base. Those poor guys have no clue what happened. Okay, another nice missile right there. And uh, we're in good shape. Oh, yeah, we're right in front of the headquarters. We shouldn't have any issues. Let's put another missile in there. Remember those energy points. Uh, you get it every time that you destroy a power plant. And um, victory is ours. Sweet. Okay. Uh, like I said, I was playing a little bit more yesterday. And I really, really enjoy, enjoy a lot the fact that the... Um, the command point situation okay the the the, the 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 fact that the units are moving in only one straight path super super entertaining because then it changes the strategy right then you really need to start thinking okay how i'm gonna deploy my units and that's something that actually happened in real life right you send the troops some troops are going in the front the mid chill right you have some other troops that are going behind and they all work together everybody every every single unit has a specific function so um that's actually i found that really interesting i was Having some extra thoughts when I was playing last night. Okay, what, what are we having here? Oh, this is our achievements. We can collect this one. 50 XP. So we We can move forward. Close to level 4. Mission complete. Do we have more missions? Okay, this one is the one that I have active. Uh, Defending gun level 3. Okay, perfect. These tasks are done. Uh, we got all the command points. And let's go to the battle. Alright, let's go to another base. I spent 7. Ooh, it's kind of running low in... Uh, in oil, that's not good. And the loot, oh, at least the loot in this one is oil. Perfect. Ooh, what is that? What is that? There's a what? There's not like MG towers. All right, not big fan now. Can I see what? What is this? No. Oh, oh boy, this is not gonna end well. Well, let's put the grenades in front, regardless, because that's that's something I have to do. And behind them, I can dis start deploying some assault. Because the assault has extra range, see. So now I have my grenadiers, and also I have my assault squad behind, producing, doing some extra, extra damage. Now we're gonna start attacking from a different path, and we're gonna try to collapse these defensive buildings in the back. Okay. The, oh, the guy missiles are way too powerful. <laughs> the guy missiles are way too powerful. All right. Keep moving forward. Yeah, all the, the positioning here is perfect because all my troops are going to be attacking directly the headquarters and the other villains. And Victor Sauer, like I mentioned before, if you plan your attack correctly, you can have a lot, a lot, a lot of fun in this game. All right, let's go back to the base. Keep moving forward. Let's collect some steel. Perfect. Okay, uh, nine more minutes for that one. Sweet. Okay, what is this? Started back. Oh, okay. Nice. Increase the mono crane. Increase the local bond. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. The crane, because I might need another builder. I only have one. I only got one. And actually, it's not that expensive. Let me double check. 4.99? Huh. Not bad at all. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Okay. Can I build a power plant? No, I need to get to level 7 or something. All right. So, things are looking quite okay. This is only 2, so let's finish that. 
I believe there is another achievement if we reach level 3. Okay, right here, you see? We got another achievement. Complete! Sweet! Okay, and now we can start upgrading uh, probably one of these steel factories one more time. Sweet! Alright, let's go. Let's see if we can... We're gonna finish uh, before end of this episode. We're gonna try to uh, unlock the armor car. That will be awesome! Awesome, awesome. Okay, we need 5 and this one. This one is 9 to attack. Oh, perfect. Okay. Why can I cannot attack that one? Oh, I need to relocate my base. Oh, okay. So apparently I need to clean this part of the map before moving to the next one. Okay, all right. Getting, like I said, <laughs> learning with you guys. Man. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This is not looking good. This is not looking good. But what about if we avoid the right side? <laughs> it's way too many infantry units. Way too many cannons. Probably is a wider, wiser idea to go and attack from the left side and just deal with the first cannon, three more cannons, and probably a couple infantry units. I think that's a smart idea. Okay, we're gonna use some grenadiers in front to attack the cannon. Let's see if we can take care of business. Nice, we're gonna start getting the. the uh, let me put the infantry in front of the grenadiers, otherwise. They're gonna die extremely fast against those infantry defensive unit. Okay, things are looking much better. We're gonna use a guided missile in there. There's some infantry also in the back. Infantry, I keep calling it infantry. This is the assault squad. Okay, the assault squad. Like I said, the assault squad got range. That is so so useful. So so useful. Uh, I should probably keep upgrading this unit instead of the grenadiers. But the grenadiers are super powerful against the uh, builders, right? Like, you cannot go wrong with that. You cannot go wrong. Okay. Still work plundered. We got a hundred in steel. And now I think we are ready to move to the next location. Major break, sir. Locals report delivery of armored cars nearby. And we're going right there. This might be our break. Have your troops hit that base and get those armored cars. Yes, sir. Ah, uh, whatever, dude. All right. So I guess we got all the troops ready. Yeah. Oh, I didn't lose any. Oof, beautiful. You know what? Let's finish this for free so we can go with our units. Upgrade it to the next level. We can probably go with this one. Upgrade. That's only four, so let's get it done. And what else can I upgrade? Let's start upgrading the guided missile. Uh, probably not going to need to. I don't need to do that. All right, let's go. Let's go and unlock right here Do -do 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 -do. the armor car. All right. We'll go over there. Can we attack? Yes, now we can attack. Sweet. 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 Oh. Ooh. Huh. Maybe, maybe, what we can do, we can start attacking from the right, destroy those uh, walls, destroy the cannons, destroy the power plants, and after that, we should have enough energy to use the guided uh, missile and destroy the big group of infantry units. That sounds like a plan. All right, let's put some grenadiers in here. Okay, let's protect the grenadiers. Protect the grenadiers. Come on, assault. Come on, assault. I don't want to run uh, low in uh, command points, otherwise we won't be able to to deploy more units on the battlefield. All right, there you go, perfect, perfect. We got my units taking care of the walls, and now we're getting super, super close to the cannons. Some units are coming back, so we got some extra energy. We're gonna get super, we're gonna get close to the power plant, and once that we have the power plant, power plant and the control, we can start using the guided mice missile. And start destroying these infantry units. Okay, you know what? Let me put it in the middle. Oh boy, this is perfect. This is like in Boom Beach. Look at that. <laughs> you put it in the middle, you destroy every single unit. Wow, we just discovered that. That's sweet. All right, let now they deploy the whole army. There is no point. There is no turn back now. Sweet. Okay, we're gonna put another grenade in there. Oh, we got plenty of units now. We have plenty of command points. And now there's not nobody can <laughs> nobody will be able to stop us because we're getting super close to the enemy base. Headquarters is gonna go down in two seconds. There's no more defensive buildings, some more units reach the end of the map. So I can keep deploying units. I'm receiving some command points back. And that is something that I like. I really like. Like I say, is that I remember when I did the first episode, I was a little bit concerned about the pathing situation. But after playing for a few extra battles, like a, hmm, you know what? That makes sense, man. Fast vehicle, especially against infantry, such as MG Nest. Sweet. All right. Let's go and use our new vehicle before ending this episode. Incompetence. Hmm. But no matter, this loss is a small price to pay for locating Zack Connor and his <laughs> rat. 
attack. Ooh, traitors. Sweet. Nice. Okay, now we got some really good goodies. Uh, do I need to... Oh, no, I need more command. I got enough command points. Sweet. Let's go over here. Now, this time, we're going to start using... We're going to relocate the base first. Travel to this location. There you go. Moving to the next part of the map. We are close. Closer to Washington. And it reached to another veteran base. Okay, what is the other veteran base? First things first. Raid some more resources to improve your base and refill your supplies. Absolutely. What is the next veteran base? Revelation of the West Coast. Ah, oh, sweet. Sweet. Okay, yeah. We're going to remove all the fog in there. Sweet. Okay. So, let's clean this area. What is this? Oh, that's Santa Rosa. We could probably need money to free Santa Rosa. But let's go and attack this fuel depot. Decent amount of loot that we can get. A lot of MG towers in front. Now, now we can deploy this. Oh, it's 10. That's a lot, man. That is a lot. Let's put some infantry in the back. And they have range. No, we don't have enough range. So we might need to keep moving forward with the armor vehicles. And the armor vehicles are not going to have any issues destroying everything. <laughs> Look at those MG. Really? Seriously? Those MG towers don't stand a chance, man. Not a chance. Not a chance. Armor vehicles for the win. Oh, this base went down in two seconds. Went down in two seconds. I don't need to deploy anything. Well, I don't, I don't have more command points. But look at how tricky the game is getting, all right? Now the units, well, they're more powerful, but but they're using more command points. So you need to plan really well before attacking a base. Otherwise, you can run out of command points. It's not just deploying the most powerful unit. You just need to be a little bit smart and figure it out. Okay, probably this one is the best for this situation. Maybe there's a lot of infantry can use a, an army, an infantry army. Instead of spending 10 um, command points and deploying an armor vehicle, which, by the way, was amazing. I was able to destroy every single one. Okay, you know what? Let's do the same. Armor vehicle, armor vehicle, armor vehicle, armor vehicle. And let's see if these guys can roll <laughs> all the way to the other side. Uh, apparently, they can. Yes, I think they can. Uh, you know what? Uh, made a mistake. I was planning to deploy. There you go some infantry and infantry army ah you know what? that's a good idea we could probably deploy an infantry army in front of the armor car because otherwise you see i don't have enough uh, range right now see i don't have enough range for the infantry army in the back to be able to engage the enemy because the armor car is the only one that is doing any damage right okay you see oh, for example let me put it behind see the armor car has range if he's behind the infantry army. Nice. Another thing to pay attention, man. Pay attention. Like it. Like it a lot. Ship on the 100. Blah, blah, blah. Ba, da, ba, bam. And I think we're doing just, just fine. Let me see. Can we keep upgrading? Clean the area two out of three. Okay. We have one more and we can clean this whole area. We're getting close to the next um, loot reward, which is this one for. I just finished that one. I'm going to start upgrading something else. What about the oil well? I need to upgrade the headquarter. What do we need to upgrade the headquarter to level 4? Required XP to unlock next level. I need 500 more in XP. And let's start upgrading this way now. All right, now let's go for the last battle of this episode. So far, so good. So, so far, enjoying this a lot, man. A lot. First episode was a little bit tricky because I wasn't sure about the game yet. Oh, you know what? Okay, we're going to put this guy first. And then we're going to deploy the armor vehicle behind. That's going to be the new combination. Let's try it. Oh, the barber wire. That's what my infant... Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Look how all my infantry units are going down. No, I forgot. Barber wire is probably not a good friend of the infantry army. Let's not do that again. Okay, let's, let's, be, let's be smart the next time, please. Wow, okay, that was a little bit crazy. A little bit too crazy for my taste. Where, where, did, where did they... Oh, I deployed the grenadiers in the back again. Okay, well... We are ready to learn something new. Be ultra careful where you deploy your infantry unit. Oh my god! <laughs> Two more died. That's no good. Wow, we received all the loot back. All the steel that we... It's gonna help me actually to... Um, re recruit my troops. Only 10. It's not bad at all. It's not bad at all. I like also the fact that you can unlock... Uh, you can deploy any kind of unit 
during the battlefield and depending only on the command points. It's not like in some other games that you have a limitation and you have to create a specific army before attacking a base, which I, I've never been a big fan of that, all right? I really want to, if I see a base, I want to be able to attack it no matter what, okay? I don't want to have the excuse like, I, oh, for example, I don't have this unit, this guy has so many of this tower and I don't have any units that I can counter that. But if you have the freedom to create your army on the fly, you're in good shape. We are getting also our intel regiment target that we can intercept. So we read more XP, and we're getting really close to level 4. Let's scout the last enemy and we advise you to kill. Okay, you know what? Let's, let's scout. Why not? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, yeah, I, I got the command points. Okay, perfect. All right, let's go to this one and find out. Let's scout this guy. The main forward base is too strong. We'll need some special munition to defend him. Okay, that's not good. Well, where are we going now? Try out the scan install and we reveal target that contain items that you can use during the camera. Oh, like what? It's one per f oh, one for free. Okay, we're gonna use the scanner for free. Oh, nice. Defeat and loot the market target and get the combat advantage we need against baits. Okay, so what is that? Let's go over there. And we're gonna get 20 extra energy points. Oh, that's sweet. Okay, let's attack this one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's keep doing this before changing, stopping or finishing this episode. Uh, what are we gonna do? I'm gonna put put this guy in front, this guy in front. Arm, armor car, armor car. Here we go. Here we go. I'm gonna put some infantry in the middle because there's no more barbed wires, right? Now we're moving forward. Now we got the armor car attacking. Oh, no, not for too long. Probably the range wasn't wasn't the one that we were looking for. But I think we're in better shape now. I think we're in better shape. Let's put another armor car in here. Barber wire is only slowing down my vehicles, but in general, I'm, I'm more than okay. I'm more than okay with that. Okay, we're gonna probably deploy this one over here. See if we can bring down that part of the base. You know what? Let's deploy this one over here. Because it's gonna be able to shoot the headquarter a little bit before going to the other side perfect okay i know i knew that's gonna happen let's see if we can between these two armor car destroy that perfect now we have a straight shot against the headquarter the grenadiers are in range no grenadiers are not in range okay that's another thing that we need to learn we need to learn different ranges of our units in order to take care of business sweet okay so now this is a supply camp nice so we got some extra nice we got some extra uh, energy points. Very good with some game changing consumable, but use them wisely. Okay, I guess we will. Ooh, almost level four. Come on, bait, it's over. The people has risen with Okay, let's go over there. It's time to fight against. Okay, you know what? Let's finish this. Uh, let's finish for free. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, and now we're going against this one. We're going to scout. Rebels come! Oh, dude, that's a fresh from the Empire, man. <laughs> you approach without surrendering, I'll show no mercy. Okay, well, you know what? I'm gonna attack regardless. What is this? Energy points. Oh yeah, now I got extra energy. So what are we gonna do? I'm not really sure. I really don't know what we're gonna do yet. Oh, we attack from the left. We can have access to. You know what? Let's. Deploy one missile right there in the middle. No bad at all. No bad at all. Okay, we're gonna put the armor vehicles. Sweet. Okay, so now I'm guessing that we're gonna get some extra energy that we can use to start destroying the defensive building. Ooh, these guys are too powerful. I don't like that. Instead of the armor vehicle, I should use grenadiers. Oh, what a mistake. What a big, big, big mistake. Huge mistake. Yeah, the cannons are not, not friendly, man. <laughs> friendly. Okay, now finally there. Okay, so now we need to start using energy. I'm going to probably destroy the... There you go. I'm going to try to destroy the cannons, if it's possible. We have more energy here. Okay, those cannons are going down. Perfect. Come on, guys. Bring me some... Bring me some more. Bring me some more. Nice. <laughs> Enjoying this 
game. Okay, what else do we got? We got more over there. Perfect. And I got one more shot, which is probably going to be good against... Uh, ooh. Over there. Perfect. Let's destroy the cannon. And the units are finally reaching the other side of the map. Sweet, 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 sweet. Okay, so now we're going to put an armor vehicle in here. Grenade in here, grenade in here. Hopefully the armor vehicle is going to be able to take care of the MG. Perfect, MG is down. Now they place some infantry. Armor vehicle one more time. And now we're getting close to the enemy base. In behind, we're going to de deploy also a group of grenadiers. And now we're in business. Sweet, headquarters going to go down. I got three couple armies couple group of units attacking the base another armor vehicle and headquarter went down wow okay so it is really tricky the game is getting really really tricky but at the same time entertaining entertaining with the armor armor car things are changing big time more breaking news the region pacific front is making a tactical retreat despite the frequent infighting the rebels have rallied behind colonel connor and connor. he's a new commander taking a fight to the region okay cool so now it's nice. time to move to the other side of the country, right? We did it! Yahoo! Okay, Jim Bates on the run. It's an honor to serve you, Commander. Uh, better be. Better be! We're gonna get 150 more XP points, and we are getting super close to level 4. The next veteran base has another value with tech, but grow a bit stronger before tackling. Perfect. I'll keep tabs on you. The army recommended to gather resources, plant this under. Okay, all right. So we're gonna get to level four before, okay, uh, to headquarter level four before moving to the next territory. Nice. Oh, this is play. These are players, man. Oh wow. Next next episode probably is gonna be PvP. <laughs> all right, fellas. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, Path of War by Nexon. If you uh, you guys want me to keep playing the game, post in the commentary section. So far, I enjoy it. This is the game, Hunter. I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.